What up y'all, T-Skip here and welcome back to the channel. So this is the second time I will be uploading this video. So last night I finished the video and I had bugs with this quest and it seemed a lot of other people were having issues too. So I put in some warnings and I uh, talked about it. Well, late last night, right before I uploaded it, I decided just to log on and it seemed all the toys I got from this quest started working. And also, I'm going to go ahead and just show this at the beginning. If anybody has already done the quest and had an issue, gigantic shout out to Feral Synapsis. Um, he put in these two scripts, and this is the one that actually helped me. I was missing a full, and I went to that location and got everything there, but it still didn't mess up. Well, when I ran this uh, script, I don't know if Blizzard pushed anything or what happened, but I ran it and a false came up and when I went to go get it, it fixed everything and I got all the achievements and all that. So just a quick show how to do this again. Thank you, Feral Synapsis. I'm going to put these in the description too, if you just want to grab them, but I'm also going to put this page. So if you want to go in here and give him a like and say thank you or whatever, but if you've never done one, all you do is highlight the whole thing, right click copy, go into your game, and just to say or anything, hit control V. That'll put that text in there. You run it and well, I've got this uh, turned off. Let's turn this back on. Sorry about that. But you can see right here where it says true, true, true. See, see, I had one last night that said false and that was my issue. So now that I have everything, I'm good to go. I've got all the uh, achievements. If you want to know about it, they're right here. They are in your collections tab and your toy box. And there's all that. So this quest is literally just about gathering toys for the new mobile game. Uh, if you don't care about toys, then you might want to skip it, but I thought it was pretty neat to get them out. So I'm going to go ahead and start the video where I started yesterday, the first part will be just the starting quest and the two and the coal and the the foil and the coin. If you want to skip that part after that, I go over the locations. And then after all of that, at the very end, I just do a kind of a toy show off and it shows you everything. So hopefully that'll wrap everything up for you. Um, that being said, let's go ahead and start it up. All right, so the first thing I've read, I have read this online too, that it seems to bug out for people who don't do the quest first. So as soon as you log in, go to your mailbox and you'll have a message from medicine, which I'm not sure, but I'm pretty sure that's a play on words for uh, Chris Metzen. You didn't know he's one of the creators of WoW. So I'm guessing that's why they named him Minson. But it says, it's a rumble promotion. Hey, you pal. The name is Minson, and I hear you're pretty good at finding stuff. See, I've been playing this game called Warcraft Rumble, but uh, I'm fresh out of coins. How about we meet up and I'll tell you where to find some. So, like I said, go to your mailbox and grab this first. So, let's go ahead and see what this thing is. If we open it up, it will get a quest. Want to play a game? I'm not going to read all that. So, well, why not? So you speak with Metzen and Valdraken. All right, so let's head on over. Oh, he's in here. So, is he up in the hidden thing? If you didn't know, oh, he's upstairs. All righty. There he is. Look at that slot machine. <laughs> All right, let's check out. Hey there, glad you can make it. You got to check out this machine. Yes, sir. And the quest, I'll let you guys read that if you're into the the lore stuff in the game. But find the find rumble coins in the roasted ram and insert them into the Warcraft rumble machine. Except. Alrighty. So. Let me 
There it is, right up here. All right, so let's grab this. Oh, there we go. Here's the coins. Right here. Alrighty, so that quest is done. So now let's run back up and check it out. Uh, as you insert the coin, uh, the fun little machine rumbles. And jingles you got a prize alrighty oh and that's part of the tra traveler's log too you walk up prize ask me about other places you can find coins all right so let's give this a try and see how this works so what I've read online is you can't just click it and it open you got to click it and then aim at the ground so let's throw this down and looks like I got Night Elf Huntress. And then it says you can use the full. I guess after you use the one mini then a quest will pop up and you use your full and let's complete this and there's one or two. Oh, I forgot to talk about that so if you go into your toy box in your collections tab when you go to uh, just your collection or your achievements go into collections and toy box and you will see all these uh, achievements that are tied to this event alrighty so since that is the beginning of the quest now I'm gonna go to all the coordinates and we can go ahead and find all the coins now we've made it to the first location you can do these in any order you want I just figured I'd stay in the Dragon Isles first the first one is gonna be right here um, 55 19 uh, and it looks like you have to collect the fools and the coins. I was thinking it was just coins. Apparently it's the fools and the coins. So we'll go ahead and collect these. We got both of these and now we'll move on to the next one. Alrighty, so we're at the next one. Uh, we're still in the waking shores and there's something else I wanted to show. If uh, they made it a little easier to find these you can mouse over and it'll show you rumble full bag or rumble coin bag so you don't have to go crazy looking around everywhere they've actually got it marked so i do like that and it will make things a lot easier so let's grab this one and we'll jump to the next one just wanted to quickly mention that this is at 3463 all right, so this will be the last one in the Waking Shores. It is at 62.79, and it will be a full bag. All right, let's move on to another place. All right, so now we're in the Anara Plains, and it's gonna be right here, where my mouse is, um, 81.77, and it's gonna be up on this ledge. So it's not down here, it's right here. All right, there's one more in this spot, so let's go get to that one. All right, so the last two bags in the Anara Plains is gonna be here at 1882, way over here in the corner. So we'll go ahead and click on these. It's the full and the coin. All right, so now we'll move on to another zone. All right, so now we're in the Zero Spam, and the first one's gonna be way over here in this corner. Uh, 747 so that'll be the first one and now let's move on to the next one uh, i just quickly wanted to say that location here and is there a span 
uh, the 747. Um, this is where mine popped up. So just know that there's a coin and a foil uh, that you have to collect from this area. That's where I messed up uh, yesterday. Just wanted to quickly mention that. All right, so the last one in the Azura span is gonna be right here, right, kind of next to this lake at 5737. So we'll grab this one and we'll pull and move on to the last location in the Dragon Isles. All right, so the first uh, bag in Thotaris, uh is gonna be right here, right outside Tear Hold at 5766. Now this one is inside this planter. I was flying around a little bit trying to figure. I thought it was underneath, but it'll be right there inside the planter. So there's one more out here. Let's go grab it. So the last two coin in full bag will be on this floating rock right here at 4958. That'll do us. Uh, this will be the last one. We'll go ahead and, or last one in the Dragon Isles. We'll go ahead and grab these and move on to the last few. All right, so the next few bags are going to be in both capital cities. They're either going to be, oh, they are going to be in Stormwind and they're going to be in Ogremar. So this can be a little tricky if you only play one character. And one thing I'm not sure of is uh, if you're a very low level, if you can loot it, I wouldn't see why not, but I haven't tested it, so I'm not sure. So you're either going to have to be really daring to go get it or just have an alt because if you open these up these are account bound so you can get on an alt and send these over to that character so i'm in Stormwind at the moment and this one is going to be at 75 85 right there at the bridge by the water so let's grab this one and we will jump to the next one in Stormwind. So the next one in Stormwind is going to be right here at 3846. It's right next to these uh, cannonballs. I had trouble seeing this one, but uh, it's the full bag and it's right there. So let's grab the last one in Stormwind before we move on to Ogremore. So the last one in Stormwind is going to be right here. Uh, it's at 3137 right here in the corner. Alrighty, so now we are going to switch over to an alt and grab the ones from Ogremar. All right, so the first coin bag in Ogremar is going to be right here at the Valley of Strength inside the inn. Uh, as soon as you go in here, walk up the stairs and it'll be right here. The second bag is gonna be right here. It's right next to that first one in the Valley of Strength. It's gonna be right outside the auction house at uh, 5475. And right behind these barrels, you'll see it sitting right here. So we'll grab this. There's one more out here and then we can send these over and then we can go ahead and collect everything. The last bag uh, is gonna be bag of full and it's gonna be right outside of Ogamar. So you fly over to the dock. And as soon as you get here at 5612, it'll be behind all the crates and whatever stuff there. So now that we have this, we can take these, run right here to the mailbox. Unless somebody dropped one. And send, we'll send it to Iron Scale. Boom. All right, so now that we've sent to that character, I'm gonna switch back and we'll go ahead and open up everything. All right, so since now we're back on a main, I can open up the mailbox and these are the ones from the Horde side. So I am in Stormwind and there's a machine here. From what I've read, if you are max level, the quest will be in Valdraken. And if you're below that or 60 or something, you'll have it in your capital city. The only thing I'm not a big fan of is I'm not exactly sure how you can complete all this stuff without being max level. Um, if you're not there, just a reminder the uh, where is it? The turbulent time waves or whatever is going on. So you got a lot of extra experience when you're doing uh, time walking. 
But with that said, let's go ahead and get the rewards. Let's go ahead and use these. Warcraft Rundle, a new look. Insert coin. And it looks like I have collected them all. So here's the achievements. And now the fool will upgrade these. It's my app. Uh, uh, we'll say one of the cool things on this, this is why I might make these my favorites. So I can just throw them out whenever. They're only on a one minute cooldown. So you'll be able to throw these things out quite a bit. Alrighty, so now let's go back and upgrade these. So now that we've collected everything, we can open up the achievement tab and you can see I upgraded all of these and they're all there. I will just say, there might still be a bug going on or maybe it's a location problem, but if you go into your toy box and just type in rum rumble, uh, they'll all pop up. But I'll say I was going to do this showcase in an area like off to the side over here in the grass and I couldn't click the mini. So I'm not sure if you have to be in solid ground to do it or it's bugged out in different areas but it seems to work in Valdraken. so i figured i'd go ahead and do that so the first one we can do is my app so once you throw them down you can click it and that's your first upgrade and then you can click again and it goes to that third one but you see how it takes forever for me to click i'm not sure if this is a bug or intended or whatnot but so the next one we'll throw down is the murloc so there's the first stage click it there's the second stage and there's the third stage so now we will do night elf huntress which i guess is Toronto. so there's the first stage closer I gotta get a new mouse and second stage and third stage all right and then the next one I'll throw down is a goblin so we'll throw the goblin down it's the first stage the second stage and the third stage and we'll go to the next one, which is a torn. And that's the first stage, the second stage, and the third stage. And the next one is a ghoul. It's there, there's the first stage, the second stage, and the third stage and the final one is the whelp egg so there is the first stage the second stage and the third stage and as you can see they're all still up but before when I was doing these, they would go away real quick. So I still think there's some kind of bugs going on in the game with them right now. Uh, you might have an issue. If you do have any issues, throw those in the comments so people can know uh, whatever helped for you. But like I said, running that script helped me. But anyways, these are the show off. So I'll move on to the outro. All right, so that's the video. Um, I'm out here in the zero span. I just uh, did one of the parts. And as you can see, I upgraded them to three. Uh, some of them out here, but like this ghoul, I got it to second and now I can't upgrade it anymore. And the little whelp, you know, I can't upgrade it all. So there has to be some kind of bug going on with these toys or 
not sure. See, I can throw this here, and now I can't even upgrade that one. This one I can't even upgrade again at all. And this one I can't downgrade. So there's got to be something wrong with the coding or something. I'm not exactly sure. Um, everything worked out for me, collecting everything and going back and running that script. Uh, it's really up to you if you would like to just wait and see if, um, you know, they fixed the kinks. Uh, that's really your call, but uh, I, I did get to complete it. So I hope everybody enjoyed this one. Uh, the beginning of the quest was just me going along with it. I know that's something just new. I, I, usually I'll just jump on and test everything first. This one, I kind of took you along for the rod. Uh, so I hope that was uh, all right. Anyways, I hope everyone enjoyed it and see you in the next one. Peace.